Do we have to save water in the Alps? Hi everyone, my name is Günther Eigner and I am an Austrian researcher on the future of skiing. The Alps are not a dry area at all. Average annual rainfall in Austria amounts to 1100 mm. This equals 1100 liter per square meter. In Austria's alpine regions, annual precipitation is even higher, the maximum being 2800 mm. You might be surprised that the long-term trend of precipitation in the Austrian Alps has been consistent over the last 120 years. This evidence was presented in our video Water Shortage and Snow Production. In Austria, only 3% of the water supply is used by our residents. The rest seeps into the earth, evaporates or drains off into rivers without being used. Let's have a closer look at the Austrian state of Tyrol, which is truly a land of mountains. Four major river systems bring water from Tyrol to our neighboring countries day and night, every day of the year. Can we affect the amount of water in these rivers by our consumption behavior? The river Inn carries the most water of all rivers in Tyrol. Its average discharge is 305 cubic meters per second, which is equivalent to 305,000 liters per second. Independent of the amount of man-made snow that is produced in Tyrol, this average discharge is untouched, regardless of residents in our country turning off the faucet while they brush their teeth or not, or how often they flush their toilet. This might sound surprising. Of course, I am not asking you to waste water but I would like you to think about my arguments for a moment. Springs in Tyrol provide water, regardless of whether they are used by people or not. The springs that are used by people, they have the duty to fill up reservoirs. If we save water, those reservoirs remain full, but the springs continue to provide water which cannot be prevented from draining off. Of course, there are some technical possibilities to prevent water from draining. Just think about the huge dams we have in the Alps for energy production. Or think about all the reservoirs built for man-made snow production. They seem to be huge, but in comparison to the annual precipitation in the Alps, their volume is vanishingly small and they do not permanently prevent the water from draining, only temporarily. Now, let us sum up our findings. First, springs in the Alps provide water, regardless of whether they are used by people or not. Second, in the Alps there is no possibility to prevent spring water from draining. Third, when people in the Alps save water at home, they do not save water, they save money concerning water costs and fees. Now, let's answer our question. It might be surprising, but the answer is no. That's all for today. I'm looking forward to a lively discussion. To participate, please use the comments section below our YouTube video. In the meantime, enjoy skiing the most fascinating sport on earth. Ciao.